Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, my name is Jess. I'm a mom. I have a four-year-old and a two-year-old, and I do lots of mommy-related videos, so if that's something that you're interested in, I would love if you consider subscribing. So this is the Lily Jade insert, and it's packed full, and I'm going to show you it inside of the Rosie, the Shaylee, the Madeline, and the Elizabeth, and if that's something that interests you, let's go ahead and take a look. Alright, so here in the Elizabeth, I have the Azoli 18 ounce bottle here on this side. I have the Munchkin 360 here on this side. Then here in this front pocket, I have hand sanitizer, travel boogie wipes, and some Kleenex. Then here on this side, I just have my small Jujube set piece that has a be charge in it, all of my cards, chapstick, that sort of thing, some gum, and my keys. And that's all for that pocket. Then in this pocket, all I have is some wipes. And then I also set my phone in on this side. And I don't have anything on this back pocket, but I will sometimes throw this strap in the back or put receipts back here. All right, now for the inside of the Elizabeth. This is what it looks like, and I'm just gonna pull up the insert and show you what I have left in the bag. So all I have left is I have this Logan and Lenora simple change pad, there's a back zippered pocket that I'll keep a pin, and then there's these two interior pockets, and this one I don't have anything, but I do have a portable charger inside of this back pocket, and I'll sometimes put the cord for my phone in this one. But that's all for the pockets of the bag. Now for the insert. So I'm just going to go from the back to the front. So here in the back, I have a custom-made Jujube med kit that I have allergy stuff, Neosporin, sunblock, band-aids, all that stuff. If you don't carry something like this and you have a smaller first aid kit, this would be a great spot for a spare outfit. I have put a spare outfit for my daughter in here before as well as a Logan and Lenora petite pouch. Then here in this pocket, I have four size 4 diapers. Here on the inside, I have snacks for all of my kids. I have two applesauce, and then I have a couple of granola bars. They're just kind of tucked inside, tuck inside there. And then I have some snacks for me in this pocket. Then here in the main part of the insert, I have a replay stack cup. So some snacks for my daughter, some snacks for my son, and then I have a Cloud9 swaddle blanket just here in the main part. Then I have a Munchkin trash bag here. And the last thing I have, these are one of my favorite things lately. It's from Etsy, I'll link her down below. But this is just barely not big enough for the Play Pack coloring books, but I know she does custom pieces, so you can ask her about making it a tad larger for you. But inside of this, it comes with crowns and this little white pad but I switched them out for some twistable crowns and then I added the play pack with the stickers that comes with the play pack and then some additional stickers and like I said the twistables and this is really nice for restaurants but also um, when we're flying, doctor's appointments, whatever it gives a ton for them to do and it fits quite a bit and it fits in these pockets really nicely then lastly, in the side pockets, I have a portable car mat for my son, which he loves. He can lay it out on the floor wherever we're going. And then I have in this side pocket, which these are surprisingly huge side pockets. But in this one, I have a little pom-pom ball. I'll also link her Etsy shop below. But basically, you just take out the pom-poms and they stick it back in and it entertains my daughter forever. So yeah, that's the inside for two kids. And now we'll look at the next bag. Alright, so here is the Shaylee. Here in this outside pocket, I have my wallet, just a small B set piece with a B charged in it, and my keys will also be in here. Then in this side pocket here, I have Kleenex, boogie wipes, and some hand sanitizer. And I usually have gum in here as well. Then here in the back pocket, I just have a Kirtland size travel thing of wipes. It does also fit my Petunia one back here. This makes for easy access. And that's all for the outside pockets. And now for the inside. So that's what the inside looks like and I'm going to pull it out for you guys to show you how the inserts packed up in this bag. 
So all that's left in the bag is the Logan Lenora Simple Change Pad tucked behind. I usually have a pin in the zippered pocket. You'll hear that a lot today. And then I have the portable charger and I usually have my phone charger in this other pocket here. But that's all for the bag. Now for the insert. And it's essentially the same as the Elizabeth. I have diapers back here, I have my first aid kit back here. The main thing that's different is the Shaylee doesn't have bottle pocket, so I have to put the Zoli and the Munchkin 360 here on the side. Then this main part is the same. I still have the replay stack cups, I still have my Cloud9 swaddle blanket down there, and the Munchkin trash bags, but this time I've also stacked in the cars and the pom-pom jar um, just on top because that's how the Shaley works is you kinda gotta stack it on top it's not as wide as the other bags then I have the applesauce and snacks still in here my snacks are still in this inside pocket and then I still have their little activity pads here in the front pockets and then there's a little room still on top of the Shaley but yeah that's all for the Shaley Alright guys, and here is the Madeline. So like the Elizabeth, this one has outside pockets. So, outside bottle pockets. So here in the front zipper pocket, before I flip it over, I have the Kleenex and the Travel Boogie Wipes. Then, once that is flipped over, here in this pocket, I have my small Jujube set piece and it's just standing up straight. It has my V-Charge, chopstick, hair tie, things like that, and then I have some hand sanitizer right next to it. I have the Munchkin 360 cup here in this bottle pocket, and then I have the Zoli 18 ounce bottle here in this bottle pocket. And then the last outside pocket is this back pocket that I have a thing of wipes in. And it fits really well, so now let's look on the inside of the Madeline. And it is essentially packed the same way as the Elizabeth. So I'm just going to pull the insert out and show you guys. As you can see, there's a little room when you zip it up on top, but not a ton, maybe for another swaddle blanket. But I'll pull this out and show you guys. So like all the other bags, all that I have left in here is the Logan and Lenora Simple Change Pad, the zippered pocket back here that has a pin, and then the backup charger, and then usually my phone cord that is also in this pocket. And that's all for the bag pockets. Then the insert is the same, like I said, as the Elizabeth here in the back pockets. I have the med kit, I have four diapers, the pom-pom jar, the car track, the stackable cups, the Cloud9 Simple, Cloud9 Simple Change Bag, no, the Swaddle Blanket, the Munchkin Trash Bags, then I have snacks for my kids here in this pocket, as you can see, if I flip it around you'll see it better, so in this pocket I have snacks for them, and then I have the snacks for me, and this just has the dried snacks, and then lastly here in the front is their activity pads, so I have one here for each of them. And that's all for the Madeline. All right, and lastly, we have the Rosie. So her pockets are the biggest outside pockets. I love them. I don't have nearly enough packed into these. But for now, I do have the hand sanitizer, my wallet. I can put my keys. I can also put my phone in here. And that would be a large amount. Then here in the back, it's already unzipped. But I have the wipes here in the back. And it is a little more packed full in the main part, but it does zip. Then, that is all. There's just two outside pockets, so we're just going to go ahead and open the inside. And this is what the inside of the Rosie looks like. It's similar to the Elizabeth and to the Madeline, how it's packed, but also to the Shaley because I have some things in the center. Because the Rosie, like the Shaley, does not have outside bottle pockets. So those are on the inside. So I'm just going to pull these out and show you guys how it's packed inside the Rosie. But as you can see... There is a little bit of room here on top, not a ton. Kind of like I said with others, you could probably fit like a swaddle blanket, maybe a jacket or two. But there isn't a whole ton of room once it's zipped up on top. But there is some for another couple things. 
All right, and I'll show you guys because I mentioned it in all the other videos. But here in this back pocket is the pin I use. It's actually from the Sensible Mama. As you can see on here, it's the pink and gold one. I bought these little pin carrying cases. I can link them below, but just in all the different colors so that even if it does get clicked with this one, it doesn't because you have to twist it, then it won't get all over here in this pocket. But then just the Logan Lenora change pad back here behind the insert, my portable charger, and my phone charger in that pocket. Then the insert is similar to all the others. The med kit is here in this pocket. The diapers are here in this back pocket. The Munchkin 360, the Zoli 18 ounce. Then here in the main pocket, I have the pom pom jar, the replay stack cups, the car mat, the swaddle blanket, the Munchkin trash bags snacks for everyone in these inside pockets for my kids also for me and then the activity pads in each of these front pockets and yeah so that's it for the Rosie all right that's all guys I hope that comparison helped you decide which bag you want to make an investment in if there's any questions you have on what fits inside of these bags that I didn't show or I haven't shown already please let me know and I'll link the Lily Jade playlist below so you can see what I've packed in these bags before Thanks for watching.